Hello YouTube, this is Robotnik is Sexy, and this is a match I had with some person in the Facebook group called Pokemon Wi-Fi Battles, and it's, I know it sounds like a really generic name, but it's actually a pretty tight system, it's a closed group, you have to ask to join, and if you're not, uh, pokemon -y enough, then they won't let you in, and there are like, I don't know, 220 some odd people in there who will, will um, use the chat a lot and ask for wife of battles. So anyway, I'm getting behind. He leads with a scarfed me spirit, um, which is really weird, and he gets static, so that's cool. Um, goes into Gligar, who I taunt. I don't want, uh, Electro to faint quite yet, so I scout for Earthquake by going into Giggity, and, um, he withdraws, and I scald, I think? No, I toxic. Okay. Probably should have subbed, um, but... All I'm going to try to do is, is uh, burn it with Scald, which I fail to, um, and I do crap damage. So he's going to get his Toxic Spikes up. But he don't, he withdraws, which is unusual, I think. I would have gone for another round. Um, but that's fine. He goes into this guy, who is not Aryu, even though we wanted to Aryu battle. He didn't know it was an Aryu. Um... But he knows now, I told him. Uh, cause, yeah, he's, he's underused. He's actually quite good. Um, as you can see from this, the Cosmic Power, um, set with Roost and, um, Stored Power, and I have Unaware on my guy, but since he has Roost, I can't damage him. So... We're actually PP stalling right now, and uh, we do it for some time, but thankfully it isn't for the entire match. Something else happens, but yeah. Unaware is not cutting the mustard because his stored power is getting stronger, and um, he just keeps healing with Roost, so it's bad news, bears. It's bad bears news. It's just bad. He's using Roost. Uh, even if I had Ice Beam, it still wouldn't do anything, because, um, yeah, my recovery is really bad. And he reveals his last move is Psycho Shift, so that's really cool. And for him, it's bad for me. Uh, the burn doesn't really bother Quagsar really that much, but it would bother a lot of my other Pokemon. I decide to switch into Beaky, my Mandibuzz physical wall tank. Um, wonderful monster. He psycho shifts the burn on that. Um, I taunt him so he can't roost. Or. Yeah, basically that. <gasps> oh, hiccup. Um. He's Brave Bird, it doesn't do anything. Mm hmm at all. It actually damages me as much as it does him, which is uh, bad, because of all the cosmic powers that are going on. Um, and this guy is, um, I asked him if he gened his guys, and he didn't. He RNG'd them, I think, um, because he had a Japanese game, and uh, he had a whole bunch of shinies, and I don't really get the point of the whole thing why it's so different from just using Pokegen or something, or why it's better. If it's better, I don't know, but, you know, I'm, I'm kind of ignorant about it, so, yeah. I guess it could be better, because, um, if you RNG, I think the game always thinks they're legit, or they are legit, or... You can upload your replays to Wi-Fi, which is how I saved this video. So that's that's a that's a big thumbs up. Uh, he ends the stall war by switching into Gligar, which is really weird, very weird. Um, 
He definitely had the upper hand, and then he just went into Gligar, and I have Toxic, so that's that's great. The tables have spin, spun, they've spun in, in circles. They're spinning the tables. So now things are looking up for me. He's using Sword Dance, and I pretty much figure that his only attacking move is Earthquake, um, and he's poisoned, um, so I'm going to take this opportunity to autonomize, and even if he does have another move, which he does, and it's Stone Edge, kind of, I would have, yeah, doesn't do anything, and then I blow his mind with Magnet Rise, and I love doing this. I haven't recorded it yet. But I've done it before, and it blows minds. Um, e even if I win or I us even if I lose or win, it, it still blows minds. So his Gligar is completely walled because I'm I'm a flying Agron, and I just double head smash the um, Miss Spirit. Spirit. Luckily, I don't miss. Um, it would have been pretty disastrous if I had missed his, um, uh, giant grass lizard man, because it would have leaf stormed me and I would have died. But, um, luckily I don't miss. Uh, it's, it's kind of weird. Whenever I used this very Balrog in Heart Gold, he would miss Head Smash, like, at least half the time. Um, but when I use him in my black version, Head Smash almost lands all the time. It's it's really kind of weird. It, I guess it's kind of a random thing, so it's not a big deal or something. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Dogs. I use Head Smash. I use Earthquake. It's on there. I use it then. Aha! Uh -huh. He ki he kills me off with cross trap, right? Um, but he faints due to life orb damage. So that's I think that's the game. Actually, I'm not even sure. No. Yeah, he's got like w one more. Yeah, just one more guy. It's Gligar and he's toxic. Well, it pretty much is the game. Don't even know why I sent a Max Headroom. I think I lost count of his Pokemon actually, <laughs> and I was just taunting him for like. Fun, or not fun, I, I don't know. It, it's really the best, it was the best a Pokemon to move into, really, because Taunt, um, so I Taunt him into Earthquake, and, um, he uses it instead of Stone Edge, so I don't die, and then I finish up the game with the Bug Buzz, and hey, everybody, that's my game YouTube, so see you all later?